bipolar people also have days like this. I got up once and I've been in the bed all day. Fighting my mind, which tells me I'm a loser, which tells me when I am in here, I'm missing time with my sons, my children, my grandchildren, my wife. I took a Xanax and a half. I don't like doing that. I get a headache. But it's weird. I'll let y'all know because, like I said, I am bipolar. Whatever. I took my medicine last night. I went to bed. I stayed in the bed most of the day yesterday. And I ain't give up, but it's rough sometimes. And I'm not looking at other people now. I'm just looking at myself. Sometimes I, it's like I hate myself. It's like I punish myself. And if I set a limit, I got to do it. I'm a man. I got to follow through. If I tell myself no, I'll say if I say I ain't going to do something or go somewhere, something inside of me tells me I can't. So I fight myself. I fight the thoughts that I'm a nobody and that I'm not good enough to be a daddy. And maybe I don't know how. But I'm trying. And I ain't giving up. Anyway, that's why I've been camping recently and I added nothing back to this show. I just want y'all to know that some people, they may not talk about it. But they struggle too. It's not just the poor people. The people with money. They struggle too. They just don't talk about it. Which is what we should do. And then apologize. I mean. That's the only right thing to do. If you said anything. I'm always the one. You know? It's just hard. And then you t I try to read my Bible every day. I think I read it one yesterday. But on the positive notes for now. Because I'm trying to build. I'm trying to be better. I just went to a life recovery class. But the devil comes so quick. You know. I steal that to which song. And we humans. So we wake up some mornings. And we don't, we don't feel like. A, I don't know. And our self just kind of takes over. Not that you do anything to break the law. But we break people's hearts sometimes. And that's part of life. Ours gets broke. We all broken. But anyway. I just want to tell somebody out there. You ain't alone. Keep your head up. And even if you feel like you ain't got nothing. And nobody cares about you. Nobody hears you. God hears you. And people do care. You gotta fight self back enough that you can hear the better voice, the true voice, which tells you you are somebody. Which I've been failing it for two days. And uh not proud of it. But uh just don't give up. I don't care what you ain't got, I don't care if you're living with somebody. With roaches on the floor. Or I don't care if you're living in a cardboard box. You're still somebody. You still had a mom and a daddy and a family and a granny. Or maybe you didn't. Maybe you was put up for adoption. God knows your story. I don't need to. Just don't give up. And you'll see the ones that love you. Because they'll, they'll, they'll go through whatever you put them through. And they'll be there in the end. Till the end. You might not talk for a while. You might not get along, but they'll be there. And I want to be one of those kind of people. But like I said, we're human. We fail. But anyway, 
So I'll say God bless y'all. You know, I always show funny videos where I'm laughing, having fun with my kids, singing around. That's like I said, one of the uppers being bipolar. But anyway, God bless y'all. Have a good day. Tomorrow's my birthday, and I mean, it's an awesome two days to be depressed and in the bed fighting myself. Tomorrow's my birthday. I'm blessed to be alive, and I ain't even look at that. Some of us got to take our eyes off of what we see and look at what we don't. And what we do see, because our families is what we have. Sometimes because of circumstances, we, we may can't go see them. I don't mean you don't love them. You're trying to do better. You hope they ain't expecting you to be something you're not, even though... You post all these good things, and they're true, so you post them. You're trying. But then they come to see you, you slip up and cuss, or you still smoking cigarettes. But it's the ones that love you, they ain't going to judge you. We got to judge ourselves. And God's Holy Spirit convicts, you don't condemn. And uh, who am I to condemn anybody? You know, I feel like I'm the least of the least. And I know I ain't. I got a roof over my head. I got a family that does care. Sometimes they may think I don't. Because in my mind, I may be somewhere else that day and I just can't get something off my mind. But I'm trying. God bless y'all. Have a good day.